Hello Faith Community, my name is Serena and I'm back again this week for Restore. And this week we're going to be talking about ownership, stewardship, and giving. Very exciting. So I will see you in a short while after you watch this little video from the live stream on Sunday. So I'll be right back to pray with you. I will see you then. Bye. Good morning. Over the past two Sundays, you've heard from Abby and Caitlin about how your donations to Faith Community Church are used for the programs here at church. Today I'm not here to talk about money. I'm here to talk about what everyone's favorite Sunday, Sunday subject is. The Green Bay Packers, of course. <laughs> uh, do we have any um, Packers fans here? Oh, quite a few. Uh, any season ticket holders? Oh, okay. Uh, those who aren't here today who have season tickets are probably already on the road to, to Green Bay. Um, does anyone here own Packer stock? All right, we have some stockholders. Does that give you a sense of ownership of your team? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Does that give you a feeling of responsibility? Perhaps to support your team, whether they're winning or losing. So what does this Bible say about ownership? Psalm 24 verse one says, the earth is the Lord's and everything in it, the world and all who live in it. That tells us that everything you have belongs to God and we are the stewards of what God has given us. When you make your pledge, to Faith Community Church, does that give you a sense of ownership? After all, you're giving back to God what he already owns. Knowing that God already owns everything in the earth, does that still give you a sense of responsibility for what your giving means? Your giving helps to support the programs that we learned about from Abby and Caitlin. Your giving helps to pay the mortgage, to keep the lights on, the heat, and the air conditioning. Your giving helps to pay the pastor's salary. Your giving helps Faith Community Church to fulfill the part of our covenant that talks about teaching and preaching God's word. Look around the sanctuary today. God owns this building, but you should feel a sense of ownership too. A year ago, with the loss of income from Faith Academy, we faced an uncertain future. We were uncertain if we were going to be able to continue to pay the mortgage or to continue the programs and missions of our church. With the Bridge the Gap initiative and some generous donations, we are once again back on track. To continue on that path forward, we need each of you to prayerfully consider how you can keep up and step up and go pack go. <laughs> Hello and welcome back. I hope you enjoyed that video and I hope it got you thinking about how you can better steward what God has given you and how you can give back because he gave it all. Would you pray with me now? God, thank you for all you have given me. Help me to use what you give to pour back into your kingdom. Whatever blessing it may be, I pray you would help me steward it well so that I would glorify you. Where there is need, help me to serve. When you call, I pray that I know your voice thoroughly so I can answer that I would remember that it's not the gift I seek, but the giver, that I would remember you, God, my provider and banner over me, that with my eyes on you, I'd take care of what you give me and would pour into your kingdom as you pour into us. Help me to follow in your example and have a servant's heart for your kingdom and your glory. Help me to use my blessings to bless others. In Jesus' name, amen.